Hi, this is Mariano from Instadec. This is the first video in a series of videos uh, where we will explore how to use the HTTP source with the SpaceX um, data to build a complete dashboard. And meanwhile, we will explore uh, different features from Instadec. So we need to start by going to api.spacexdata.com slash v2. And there, there's a JSON document that doesn't matter a lot, but uh, there's a docs uh, field that we can open and it contains the documentation and uh, what we are going to be using is the launches uh, data uh, specifically the all launches and we can see here that uh, the URL is available here and so that we create a new visualization select the HTTP source and as you can see by default um, the default value is uh, this and because so you can start playing it uh, right away and the interval so that means how often it will ask for new data is 60 seconds so we click OK and we can see that the data uh, returned is uh, a record with a body field which is a list which now has 92 items and a status um, attribute which uh, 200 meaning OK it's a HTTP convention so we can see we have a lot of uh, data. The body field is a list, and for each item it has a lot of attributes uh, or fields. And we are going to start easy by w we see that there's a launch year uh, field, so we can count how many launches were per year. So we drag the launch uh, year field to the key uh, section on the summary. And we, since we are just counting how many items there are, we can count anything here. The, either you, we can wait 60 seconds for, for the data to load again, or we can just uh, click uh, reload. And as we, you can see here, um, we, we are just uh, counting the first item on the list. So to do it for all the items in the list, we have to drag the iterator of the list and it will ask us if we want to apply it to all other paths with the same prefix, which is this one. And, and now, if we reload it, uh, we can see that um, we are counting it. But there's one thing. Um, there was only one launch in 2006, as far as I know. So what what's happening is that uh, 60 seconds passed and the new value came and so we, since we are receiving all the data per request we are counting updating the count for each update so what we need to do is go to show more settings and do clear before each update so now you can see that 2006 has one and it will have one no matter how much time it passes so now with this we can go and select the chart we are going to go with bar chart we can see the number of launches and if we want to since uh, the different years don't have any difference we may want to pick a uh, one color for all of them so for that we are going to add a new attribute or field called color and we are going to pick uh, one color and with instadec you can define one color for each of the, of the keys so that's why you have to drag it here so for each key you will have one color in this case it's all all the time the same color and if we expand the settings on the bar chart you can drag this and you will get uh, a uniform color we will rename it to launches by year and this was the first uh, chart we built we saw how to get the data how to uh, do a calculation over items in the list and how to define a color uh, for, for the entries. 